Bryant is already there. The Bulldogs begin NEC tournament play Wednesday at St. Francis of PA. Maury Hirsch Gordon caught up with the team today. Well, it's one final practice here at the Chase Athletic Center for the Bryant University men's basketball team as they begin their quest to reach the NCAA tournament. It'll start at the number one seed, St. Francis University of Pennsylvania, on Wednesday night in the quarterfinal round of the NEC tournament. A new coach, a new system, and a revitalized fan base has Bryant Hoops back in postseason play. It's March now, and this is a time where you kind of make dreams come true. And Just three wins separates the Bulldogs from the coveted NCAA tournament. Their first test, a date with the top-seeded Red Flash. Once you're playing in March, it's about being the best team on that night. And for us right now, it's about being our, the best we can be on Wednesday and putting ourselves in position with our preparation the next couple days to be in position to win a basketball game. The key for Brian is all about defense. In every single win this year, they've held their opponents to less than 70 points. Defense is just our, our focal point. We, we need to focus in, lock in. For us, it's about defending the ball, holding teams to one shot. And when we do that, I think we're a pretty good basketball team. And the Bulldogs will follow the leadership of their head coach. Jared Grosso's name is synonymous with postseason success. Having Grosso on our side is like we're in our best advantage right now. He's come from a winning program. You know, he's done this before. He's been there. He wears his March Madness stuff around us all the time. We've seen the rings, the nets. Eight seed, one seed, four seed, it doesn't matter. you got to win three games in March to go to the NCAA tournament. And I've been through it before and in the past at Iona. I've been blessed to have that feeling of cutting down nets and being part of a pile. And I'm hoping my guys will have the opportunity to do the same thing. And the Bulldogs plan on traveling to Western Pennsylvania on Monday night. They'll practice and prepare one final time on site on Tuesday before all the action begins Wednesday night at 7 o'clock. In Smithfield, Maury Hirsch Gordon, Eyewitness Sports.